Hello, I'm Maurice Dimba. Welcome to this presentation. Today, I'm going to briefly discuss with you on how to create Riba shop drawings using a cast unit tool in Tecla Structures. Welcome once again to this presentation as I take you through briefly on how to quickly create some or uh, uh, I mean to create some Riba shop drawings in Tecla structures using a tool called cast unit drawing tool. Now to access that tool you just switch back to a draw, uh, drawing and reports then you click on create drawings under that drop down arrow you'll find that tool there and uh, it is great because uh, the particular uh, component or um, I mean beam or uh, slab or column that you want to create uh, shop drawings from a uh, riba shop drawings from hasn't been selected so the moment you select uh, in this particular case we want to create to uh, at least generate a riba shop drawing on on this beam but because we haven't selected the beam that is the reason why it is great. Uh, I mean, it is inactive, and uh, we cannot be able to select it before picking on the part we want to generate Riba shop drawings from. Now, we'll quickly go to the part we want to create the drawings from. We want to we want to create a drawings from this part. Let me first of all come out of that command first. Now we want to create Riba shop drawings from that beam and I'll press control and pick the same. And please note that uh, the beam sizes and the Riba inside the beam, uh, inside the RC beams are the same. So I'm just picking the two just to make our, our the final drawing to look more presentable. Now, I, I'm just picking the two, uh, even though we can pick one because one represents all. And uh, uh, in terms of size of the RC beam and in terms of uh, the size and the spacing of the rebars inside the beam. Now, I'll go straight and create the rebars from the beam. Now, I'll go straight, having gone to drawings and reports, I'll come to drawings, drawings properties uh, and... Uh, come to that drop down arrow and click that so you see the moment you've selected uh, where you want to generate your riba uh, your shop drawings from in this case riba this cast unit drawing becomes active let me take you back now the moment i deselect it i deselect it by clicking on on an empty screen like this and I'll try to go back under drawings and properties. You'll find that it is an inactive. Uh, I mean, create drawings. You'll find that it is an active. Uh, create drawings. It is an active. So the moment I select, I select this, and come and come here and select that, and come to create drawings. It will be active and i'll come back again that these two here we have drawing properties where we you set your uh, how your drawings uh, I, mean, I mean how you want your drawings to look like you set them here under cast unit drawings here you'll set we'll set under this now on create drawings this is where you create the drawings using that tool you know you see here it is active but the moment we deselect where we want to generate our riba shop drawings from the moment we go back let me deselect that now if we go back here let me just click on that drop down arrow it isn't active now let's just go straight away and create our ribas i'll select that and come back here and select that beam. Now I'll go back to create drawings using 
this tool, Cast Unit Drawings, and click on that. And I'll wait to get the results. Just give it some minutes. There we are. If you come down here, you'll see creating drawings, uh, creating drawing finished. One drawing has been created successfully. Then we'll go to to drawings and reports. Then we come to drawing list. And uh, we can ma make this slide bigger so that we can see everything clearly. Now, if you take a look here, we generated some drawings uh, for for after beams on second so we can easily access this because the date is different this is third october 2017 now we can go uh, we can go ahead and double click on that and check the content or how the riba uh, riba shop drawings has been presented to us we'll minimize this We'll minimize that. This is how briefly this can be done using cast unit drawing. And uh, you see this, these are our rebirths. And uh, startups, one is enough to represent the rest because the size is the same, the spacing is the same. So once you've been given this, is enough. And now, ninety-nine is the number of the river of the startups. Now we'll come come here and double click. And I mean, don't double click. Just scroll, uh, pull down this death. of our view we want to see everything completely let's drag this up slightly drag it up slightly and drag it this down we want to see even the pad footing perfectly well now our main target was the rebus how we can quickly Mm, create or do uh, do uh, shop drawings for ribas and uh, at least we can present this to someone for just a discussion this is how we can do this so quick and remember you can always open this to see all the parts you, you drag you click and drag that these were the bracings and uh, these are the columns and this is RC beam where it is supported with the uh, uh, stab it is a stab made of steel perfectly well done and uh, that is the section of that beam we can s we can find it here and remember you can as well scale rescale this to be more visible we double click on that and change the scale to maybe 10 modify apply and accept that's it and drag it somewhere you can see it clearly right there and this one also you can drag that end perfect remember this is just a brief discussion how to quickly create uh, Ariba shop drawings the detailed part where we will include even the title blocks will be done in the next presentation where we will we'll handle this extensively We can drag that that side. These are uh, plate. Uh, I mean uh, stiffeners for the column. This is the base plate, and this is our grout. This 
is the pad footing. These are our columns. Stub plate, our beam with ribbers inside. These are the descriptions of the ribbers. You can we can quickly run this and uh, uh, submit or prepare for submit for any discussion with the concerned parties. Thanks a lot for watching this video. I'm Morris Dimba and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Let's meet on the next presentation.